Hello and welcome to its tomorrow news. This is R. Sri Ram. Storm Ashley, UK weather warnings mapped as winds hit 80 miles per hour. Yellow and amber weather warnings for wind and rain have come into place as parts of the UK are set to be hit by Storm Ashley on Sunday. Heavy rain and 80 miles per hour winds are predicted in areas with the first named storm of the season likely to bring a threat of injuries and danger to life, the Met Office has said. A yellow warning for wind came into place for the entirety of Scotland and Northern Ireland and parts of Northwest England and Wales at 3 a.m. and runs until midnight on Sunday. An amber warning for the Northwest of Scotland has been issued from 9 a.m. until midnight with a weather service warning injuries and danger to life is likely from large waves and beach material being thrown on to coastal roads, sea fronts and properties. Met Office meteorologists explain very strong severe gales on Sunday coincide with high spring tides, which could also result into very large waves. The north of Scotland remained under a yellow warning for wind from midnight until 9 a.m. on Monday. Further south, the Met Office has issued a yellow warning for the southwest of England and South Wales until midday on Sunday with a threat of disruption to travel with flooding and possible interruptions to power supplies. Meteorologists said strong gale force winds were due to continue through to Monday morning, meaning fallen debris and trees could affect commuters at the start of the week. Additionally, the Met Office said Sunday was a widely windy day with storm force winds in the northwest. Several cities in the south of England will welcome warmer temperatures, with Exeter recording summary highs of 17 degrees, while London, Brighton, Bristol, Bournemouth and Southampton will peak at a comfy 16, according to the Met Office. This is despite the UK being hit with thick, dense fog in recent days, which looks set to linger. Last week, the forecaster issued an amber weather warning telling Britons the fog would likely cause problems of visibility and major travel chaos. But a new weather front moving in from Northern Europe means dry and sunny spells will take over the south for half of the week, with little to no disruption expected from the residual fog. That's all for now. For more weather news updates, stay tuned with us on this tomorrow news. For more global weather updates like this, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you.